what's up guys welcome back to the channel and we've got a new toy guys check this out the armor infraction v2 and i've done a lot of research on these and looked into these and listened to what everyone else out there is doing with them and oh man i, I just i couldn't help it i had to get one so here it is this is going to join my little fleet and it's going to be on the channel for Brad JRC and I'm looking forward to getting this out and tearing it about but I've got to say a big thank you to my buddy Ben so I did a little bit of work for him and he donated this to the channel for me so thanks for that Ben really appreciate it mate and got some great content coming up for this I do want to take it out I do want to give it a run but it's so cold, it's so wet out there, we're on lockdown. So I think what I'm gonna do is I've watched the other guys on their channels and the bits and pieces that you should do really. So like the inner fenders, um, I wanna do some skid plates and stuff underneath, um, some other infield pieces. So I think what I'll do is I'll hold off because while the weather's like super bad at the moment, get those bits ordered up, get those on the car, and then take it out for a blast. But if we do have a dry day, if it is dry, then I feel I might have to just take it out for a quick blast. But I'll, I'll catch some video footage of that if I do. Um, but in the meantime, let's crack this open and have a quick look. Right, so this is running the Spectrum Smart DSM, and being the version two, this has got the handbrake function. But look at this body, man. Oh, don't they just look like they're, they're going 100 mile an hour without moving? So they're just beautiful. Let's pop that on one side. So we've got the two battery compartments. We've got the Spectrum Firma 4074, which is the 2050 kV motor in there. Um, they put out a lot of punch. So let's take a little look around the other side. Uh, so this is the Smart Spectrum Smart ESC. Got a little capacitor a bit on there. This is the little handbrake function in the middle. And check out that rear diffuser, man. Look at that. That's just awesome. But you know what surprised me? Was when I opened the box, and I've never seen one of these in the flesh before, and the first time I opened it was today. I opened it up, and I couldn't believe how long it was, how big it was. You know, I thought it was gonna be sort of that sort of size. But, mate, it's awesome. Look at that. I love it. I can't wait to get it out. Uh, I think my boy's going to love it. He's going to be itching to have a little go. All that's left to do now is to put these inner fenders in. I think the side skirt extensions, the infills, and some titanium bits on the bottom. So, because we definitely want a bit of sparkage, we want to get some of that out of there. We'll give it a run, have a little blast, enjoy it, get used to the car, and I really, really, I do want to go at some stage to 8S on here. Um, going to order up some more tyres as well, but apparently they, they, you, these, they go through tyres pretty quick. So um, I do know that there is uh, some other ones, so G, GRPs, uh, but I'll have a little look into that, see if I can get some new, new wheels and tyres ordered up. So we've got them spare and get it out and give it a run. So this is new to the channel and plenty more coming. Can't wait to get this out and film this all for you guys out there. Get some great content and footage of it all. Uh, plus with the other cars as well, just wait for the weather to get a bit better and we can get out and start doing some bashing. So just a little quick video, what we've got new to the channel. Thanks for watching. Please share, subscribe, tell your friends. And I'll catch you in the next video.